Hello everybody, Resented here, back in Isaac, doing the daily for the fourth day in a row. I have one, no wait, it's the third day in a row, ain't it? I think so. But I've won two runs in a row. Two runs, why did that sound so weird? Two runs in a row. Uh, this is a Maggie run. Yesterday's was an Isaac run, pretty uh, like standard, because Isaac is... Like a standard character. We do get a speed upgrade. I do... Actually, no. Fuck it. I do want Shard of Glass. I don't think it's... Amazing, but I think it's good. And so... I feel like the uh, damage was justified. And you might as well... Take the damage to get it, because... It was a floor one... I was gonna say, wait, is there a Curse of the Labyrinth? No, but um... You know, it's a... Floor one, room one... Item... You might as well do it because you're not going to be using Yum Heart very early in the game unless you take uh, some ridiculous damage. There's a Tinted Rock, so here's what we do. We do that. Boom, two Spirit Hearts. We use one more bomb over here. Maybe I should have put it like over here somewhere, look for a secret room, but... It's honestly not that big of a deal. And before I do get the Spirit Hearts, I am going to go into the Curse Room. We get Spotters. Oh god, the tier rate's so bad. And a few flies, okay. Not that big of a of a haul, but with Yum Heart, it's not gonna make much of a difference. And since I did not pick up the Spirit Hearts, maybe I should have saved them for the very end. I mean, Ragman's not too difficult. He is a little bit of a of he's the one of the more difficult floor one bosses. So I mean he has that going for him. But like for like from like a balance standpoint, he's pretty balanced because like he doesn't really do a lot of damaging attacks as opposed uh, excluding the uh, homing shots, which is a little unpredictable. But as long as you're far enough away and you fire at like a medium distance, you should be fine. And then, you know, he's just sort of like pseudo tanky in that, ooh, there it is. He's pseudo tanky in that he spawns all these spiders and then he revives them and, you know, you have to deal with... Also, I keep uh, breaking my point to say other points, but I got super lucky in that I killed the spider as it was going to touch me from jumping. But yeah, he's pseudo tanky in that, you know, you have to keep killing his spiders over and over again. So that does give him, like, a, a sort of fake tankiness, but we did just fine. No damage taken. Old bandage is okay. And with two and a half spirit hearts, I do feel like a deal with the devil is pretty much guaranteed unless I somehow screw up this room. I do know each of these dudes takes three hits. So as long as you know, like, relatively, like, where you are in terms of damage and how many hits enemies take to kill, you should be able to make some decent decisions. Little chest is good. Uh, any spirit hearts here? No. Okay. And I'm not too upset. I just was hoping... With all those rocks. Okay, thank you. That wasn't a little chest, was it? Or was that old bandage? I think it was old bandage. The little chest doesn't drop just normal consumables. He drops exclusively chest-related stuff, correct? Oh, one bomb for a chest. I'm probably going to save it, to be honest with you. And we'll see if me saving it helps out. I mean, two bombs now kind of just want to... I should probably go ahead and do it. I'm going to use the two bombs I picked up to open up the jars, which gave me nothing. Then I will... I don't think I am able to get the chest and a secret room, so I'm going to just secure the secret room. Ooh. Almost makes the shop worthwhile, but not entirely. I can get a half-off item. I can get a spirit heart. That's about it, and I'm not too interested in either of those right now. And I'm actually pretty decent on health right now. Ah, uh, you fucker. Old Bandage paid up with two red hearts, though, which is pretty good. Uh, I think Fistula does deal a whole heart of damage, 
when it touches you. Also, I'm in like the worst situation in that I look like I didn't even. Oh god. I wasn't even able to break off uh, like a big piece into a smaller piece and then destroy the smaller pieces. I broke like every piece into its smallest component. And now I can't get hit at all. If I lose the deal with the devil here, I'm gonna be so upset. Just fucking end it all. I'm done. I knew I was gonna get hit eventually. I couldn't keep up the dodging charade. So that sucks. I mean, there's theoretically still a chance, but... Oh, and it drops a spear heart just to... Just to taunt me. So fuck you, game. Let's just chalk up this deal with the devil as, uh... As it wasn't good. And use the guaranteed devil deal on this floor to, uh... Supplement the... Lack of one last floor. But, you know, getting a deal with the devil kind of, uh... Recommends you not get hit. Especially, like, three or four times on the fistula fight. But in my defense, Fistula with my base damage, ooh, that's a charged key. Not very useful for my item, but could have been useful in a few other situations. Fistula is a little bit of a, of a nebulous boss, like with a relatively low tier rate that we start with. Like Maggie has pretty bad DPS and Fistula can be relatively tanky. Brown cap. I actually think is bad. I think it's like makes poops explode. I really don't like. I really, really don't like this room. Oh my god. I couldn't have not been the fleshy versions. Yeah, I mean. Just kill one, please. Also, our speed is. I feel slow, even though I have base speed given the speed upgrade pill that she started with. Just stay up there and I'll stay down here. Thank you. Okay, little chest, you also have not paid out with anything as far as I'm aware. So if you could get your fucking shit together. I am gonna reroll this. We are kind of desperate right now for anything. Uh, anything else? Come on. Oh, fuck yes, though. Yeah. I think with base damage, it's not that great, but it just takes a little bit to become really... Also, it's still pretty good, even with base damage. Like, that's, that's surprising. Okay, just kill something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. Oh, my God. So, this was... A damage upgrade that I was sort of hoping for a little okay so little chest does pay out with uh, like just like drops it doesn't uh, actually pay out with just chests which I thought it did I guess it might have like a higher chance of paying out with chests but um oh, I also fired down on accident I'm using the analog stick now so that I can like rotate the uh, which way I'm firing as I as I need to Stars card. I already have been to the item room. Just be careful here. These tanky dudes do a sort of uh, war of attrition in that... Okay, that didn't move also when I fired it? That was very weird. It's like you get impatient because it takes so long to kill them, but... Show a little restraint. The stain is okay. I think... This looks to be a, like a champion version. I actually don't know. It looks slightly darker than normal. Could be because it's a champion version. Okay. Also, with Tech X. Is it Tech 10 or Tech X? Let me know what you guys say, alright? Because it's a it has an X. But also all the other technologies have like a number. Tech point five. Technology, technology two. Haven't made a tech, tech 3, though. Don't know what makes this one like a 10, the 10th version, and the other ones are 1, 2, and half versions. You know what? I'm going to say with the Dark Bum and the Judas's Shadow that this was a good deal of the devil, even though the last one, uh, we don't know what it, what it has. Oh, he already paid out. Oh my god, my fucking throat. I need a... 
I should have got a sparkling water because uh, my throat is a little famished from me, from me recording so much. I mean, not so much. Uh, it's just I'm not I'm not used to the recording. My my voice isn't used to the recording just yet. So I just finished the Necro Dancer Daily Challenge and. That took about uh, 40 minutes, because it used to take, you know, 20 to 30 minutes, but now that they have Zone 5 introduced with the Amplified DLC, Necrodancer runs, they get up there in terms of uh, length, so you gotta be careful. Oh fuck. I knew. I was, I was wondering if it was gonna pop or not. I might, after this, I might just use uh, the stars. Just take me to the item room. It's okay. It's uh, maybe better than most bomb synergies. Because I think it spawns spooters. Little, little spooties. Oh god, careful. Ah! I almost got stuck. Also, every now and then they just don't move. Is that like because I'm using an analog stick or some other weird reason? Like this. What do we got? Curse of the Maze. Not bad. It could have been Curse of. Uh, Curse of the Lost. That would have been bad, but. I'm okay with with maze. Justice. Justice. Good. Help down, motherfucker. Fuck this pill rotation. Careful. Careful, careful, careful. Also, I lost my fucking Tech X goggles. This is a, this is the worst bug in the universe. We got to Paul Edmund McMillan, creator of such games as Binding of Isaac and Super Meat Boy. Okay, can you stop dropping troll bombs, please? Wish I got the Perthrow rune before I went to the item room, but I mean, egg sack bombs is, is fine. Oh shit. Almost got me there, boy, but not quite. Please give me a spirit heart. Oh, it's just like yesterday's run. Oh, you know what? Fuck you, Curse of the Maze. You helped me, alright? You think you're doing harmful things, but I know your true intentions. You actually like me. Okay, also, fuck this room. And I just lost any potential deal with the devil that I had, and that... <laughs> oh, fuck you. I should have let you have it. God damn it. Uh, I could try and get the... Uh, can you... Come on. Let's do it, I guess. Give me a nickel, thank you. That lets me use this. Car battery with Yum Heart could actually be pretty good, but right now it's not too great. Thank you. I will do this just because I'm I have a surplus of bombs. Might as well. Okay. Could have been worse. Ah, brown cap, you mother fucker. <laughs> I should have taken any other trinket, I just should have not taken... I should have just not taken this. Okay. Fuck! I hate... Big Horn! We've had Big Horn like the last three fucking daily challenges. Fucking stupid. I hate it. He has three arms. He's not supposed to have three arms. Did he have three arms actually? Did three arms pop out of the holes? That's true. That's... The that's uh, not right, man. <sighs> what do we get? Child's heart. You know what? Fuck you, brown cap. Taking child's heart. Let's go. Should have gone to the curse room. Fuck it, though, alright? Just fuck it. Fuck Big Horn. Fuck Gluttony. Give me health, alright? Don't take my deal with the devil. Or just drop a lot of red hearts so that Dark Bum can, you know, do his, do his magic. But it just seems like the recent date, like, just the past four dailies have taken so long. Like, each run has been 50 minutes, and this run doesn't seem like it's gonna be any different. Just like, even though we have Tech 10, Tech X, whatever, it's still, like, base damage, no DPS... It's like a lot of these runs have been like high defense, low damage, and that's one of the worst runs you can have because it's just like, it's just a war of attrition. You just, you know, you do a lot of, you do 
very little damage, but you have a lot of health, and it's just like you can't die. Oh, can you like, wait, hold on. What the? It seemed like the tech X like curved upwards. I don't know what that was. I was trying to make it do it again. Oh, we got the boss fight immediately. Holy crap. Oh my god. Please, just give me a deal with the devil. Give me, like, fucking anything. Like a brimstone or something. Guillotine! It's so bad. It's a tears upgrade, but, like, whatever. Brownie! Great! I think we got Brownie on the last floor. Brownie fights really stupid because it's really hard to not get hit. But thankfully... Thankfully, uh, we were able to, like, kill all the little enemies that he spawned. I hate fucking guillotine. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, God, Halo. You know what? Halo's good. Krampus fight. Not, not amazing. But I'll take whatever he drops because... Uh, I want to get rid of Yumheart. And... Lump of Coal is just good. It's just a passive, decent upgrade. Just Krampus' head. I am going to take it. I was hoping for like an actual deal with the devil though. I guess just let's blow up some of this, see if we get some black hearts. We got ghost fucking baby, but we did get a black heart. That is what I asked for. So black heart plus ghost baby is a better than expected haul. Not gonna use Krampus's head. Is that a Gemini? A key for Gemini? Oh, two keys. No, it's one key because uh. You get a key back, so I'm gonna take it. I don't think Gemini is, you know, particularly great, but basically, it's in, like an extra item room because you just paid one key to get an item. So, not that bad, honestly, because we still do have the item room and we can get, you know, an extra item there. Oh shit! Did you fire my body? What was that? Guillotine makes the targeting seem really strange because they don't target like your head and that's where you sort of that's where you sort of expect your hitbox to be but it's really your little body there also why did I come in here I don't have any money I want BFF but I don't know why I wasted a key oh I have been to the item room ah, I'm stupid okay well I mean let's pick that up I guess Dark Bum, help me! You can fly! Get me that. Nickel. Okay, let's just leave. I know I can get an... Oh, I know I can get an exploration bonus. I really don't care about that right now. Uh, I'm sort of focusing in on just winning the run because we are pretty close to being able to get the five wins in a row. And I'm not very good at Isaac. I'm I'm okay. You know, I played a shit ton of original Isaac, but you know that skill only translates so far to to rebirth. I have like half as much, half as many hours in rebirth as I do in original Isaac, and uh, I think it shows. I do have you know knowledge of items, but that only gets you so far. Uh, yeah, fuck it. I might as well like you know get money and get a chance of some good stuff happening. Uh, I think... Okay, that's perks. Infested. Infested. Oh, the money's on the inside. Eh. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. A bomb and, a, and two keys for whatever's in there. I don't know about that one. I'm a little desperate. I don't think I'm that desperate. If I get a key down the line, I might do it. Or if the item room contains jack and shit, I'll think about it. It contains both jack and shit. <sighs> I don't want to do this. I hate doing this. There we go. Fuck you. Get exploded, son. Uh. Did get an increased deal with the devil. Also, I'm sort of saving Krampus' head because I, I'm like saving it for a room that I'm like, okay, I'm definitely gonna get hit. I don't think I've actually gotten hit at any point. I did take damage from the curse room and from the spikes, which was stupid. Uh, but I haven't actually gotten hit from like enemy damage. So I mean, I guess that's okay. 
So it's not like Krampus's head would have saved me from damage I otherwise wouldn't have taken. So, ooh, Whipworm is good. This gives you better shot speed, but I'm gonna take store credit and child's heart right now. Is that the shop? I, t I can't remember if that's the shop or if that's the, uh, or if there's like a double key room there. I forget. I don't know. I got, woo, excuse me. It was a long day of work today. On Zeus. Might as well, eh? Yeah, that's uh, definitely the shop. Alright, let's go, 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 go. Store credit. I don't really care about using store credit on a deal with the devil. Uh, I'm just gonna see if there's anything good. There actually is not. So, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna blow that fire up, drop this shit. Pick that up. Pick that up. I guess pick up store credit, use it for a deal with the devil. That's a death card, so we're gonna save that. Oh, fuck. I also completely forgot about boss rush. There's no way I'm gonna be able to make it. So I might as well, uh... Oh, I feel so bad. It was completely doable as well. But I'm not going to sweat it. I'm just going to, uh... Take the time. Do some exploration. If I don't make a, a good score, which I haven't in the last few runs, I'll be okay with that because I'm sort of focused on... I'm sort of focused on just winning the runs so that I can get the achievement. But well, then from there, I'll... Uh, just doing uh, the extra dailies in a row without the incentive to win, I'll probably... Uh, you know, do uh, more, more fun things, like focusing on, on score instead of just winning. So you know, we'll we'll see how that changes up my my play. Did I go? I did not fight the mini boss. Just fuck it. Just... Oh, with car battery, that makes it actually really good. Yes. Oh damn it! And I got petrified poop, but it was too late. I already unleashed the poop destroyer. All right, there we go. And we still got like a decent amount of change from that, so. Uh, petrified poop at this stage. Honestly, I think it's pretty good though because you are able to destroy poop. And as you saw from there, we did get some hearts. So that synergizes pretty well with Dark Bum. And it doesn't seem like Child's Heart is really paying out with anything. So, screw it, dude. Go with the, go with the Rocky Poo. Unable to get that chest, unfortunately. Oh my god, yay, so much. I'm not even tired. This happened yesterday, too. It's just my body's uh, been at work, and so, like, my body's in, like, work mode. It's like, why are we just sitting here just doing basically nothing? The only exercise is my hands, because I'm. Holding a gamepad. Also, we're not gonna have a charge for. Ooh, almost got me, you fucker. Not today, though. Empress. I think Empress is Empress is better. And we're. Oh wait, the run ends here. Oh, so I have. Oh my fucking god, I should have been paying attention more, because now. I really should have done boss rush because you are, it's weird, I think you are able to get boss rush on a mom daily, but you aren't able to do hush on a mom's heart daily, which is weird, but I think that's how it is, also use empress you dumbass fucking dumb, ah, but yeah. So I should have definitely done boss rush because now I'm going to lose out on a shit ton of points. I'm gonna be in like a millionth place. Yep, there it is. My. Yep, I guess take the Polaroid. And maybe some people were able to figure out a way to go to keep going, but yeah, for <laughs> almost 4,000th place on score. But you know what? That was a very short run, and that actually helps out 
not really helps out, but it, it uh, it's a good contrast to the previous previous runs, which were 50 minutes plus each. So you know what? I'm happy that that was a pretty short run. I think that was a pretty good run. It could have uh, been so much more if I paid attention to the floor I was actually going to, uh, and I, I would have you know put a little bit more pep in my step. But anyways, uh, hopefully I'll I'll be smarter about the run tomorrow. We'll see. Probably not, but we'll see. Anyways, thank you so much for all of your views, and thank you everyone for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please show your appreciation by liking, commenting, subscribing, all that garbage, and I'll see you guys next time.